Hi guys, X Jimmy may not be well known in the Western markets, but is quite popular in Asia for its range of projectors. In recent years, they have pushed into the US market with products intended for this part of the world. The Horizon series was teased all along the beginning of 2021 and we are reviewing the Horizon Pro in this video which is their highest stent 4K smart projector offering. While it looks similar to the H2 in shape and size, both the 1080p Horizon and 4K Horizon Pro offer a large number of improvements, with these being the brightest units from XJimmy, especially the Horizon Pro is aiming to challenge the budget 4K projector segment in the US with its intended price and performance. XJimmy ships the Horizon Pro in a cube-shaped white box that looks very much like what you would expect when buying a modern phone these days. It essentially lacks any excess branding or marketing elements, with an image of the device on one side and just the legal minimum of text on the others. Upon opening the box, you are greeted by foam spacers that hold the Horizon Pro in place. Underneath of that is a second compartment that stores all the accessories of the 4K projector. The power supply that ships with the XJimmy Horizon Pro is very sturdy and rather large. It can be used with both 110 and 220 volt outlets, so all you need is the right cable for it to function. The remote is made out of aluminium and rather tall and skinny. In comparison, the Apple TV, Google TV or Threat alternatives are much shorter with a similar set of buttons. XJimmy includes a very thick and detailed multi-language manual along with some warranty and FAQ documentation. Out of the box, the XJimmy Horizon Pro looks rather similar to the H2 in shape and size, but the inner workings are naturally quite different. The Horizon Pro on its own clocks in at just under 3 kilograms. XJimmy does sell an official bag to store and transport the Horizon Pro for around $70, so there is an element of portability you won't get from bigger units out there. Even so, the XJimmy Horizon Pro is a so-called smart projector as it comes with Android TV 10.0 built in. With its 2GB memory it should be able to handle most basic of e-tasks just fine, and 32GB of storage means you can install Install plenty of apps or add a few movies and shows to the device in advance if you won't have internet connectivity at your destination. XJimmy doesn't mention which processor is inside the unit, but it's probably a dual core unit. Looking at the front, there is the lens on the left and a sensor array for auto keystone and focus on the right. At the rear, XJimmy has placed a vent for internal active cooling to exhaust air. This is also where you will connect the power brick next to an optical output, two USB 2.0 ports, two HDMI 2.0 inputs, and an Ethernet port, as well as a headphone out at the very right. Both sides of the XJimmy Horizon Pro feature a vent, which acts as an intake for airflow and a speaker grill for the built-in 8-watt Harman Kardon speakers. Just like the Mogo or Halo series, the Horizon Pro sports a few buttons on the top of the unit for volume adjustment, play pause, and power state. In the front, XJimmy branded the lens with the official 4K logo to let you know that the projector is capable of the resolution. Naturally, it would have been nice to see a lens cover to further protect this part of the Horizon Pro something their previous product offerings don't include either. The sensor for auto keystone, object detection, and focus looks quite similar to what we have seen with their smaller Mogo series. Most of the magic happens in software, which interprets the intake from these sensors based on the projected image. Lastly, you will find mounting for a floor stand or the ability to attach it to the ceiling on the bottom. The inclusion of a kickstand to adjust the angle upwards just like with their more portable solutions would have been nice, but odds are the XJimmy Horizon Pro will find a more permanent spot in your living room setup anyways. Taking a closer look at the remote, the black area comes with a circular 4-way interface and central OK button. Above that are the Google Assistant, Quick Settings, and Power State buttons. Below it are the usual Android TV navigation keys and a pair of buttons for volume control. On the bottom above the battery compartment is an autofocus button. The remote takes two three of batteries with its compartment popping out by pressing down on the little lock on the back. Once inserted, the center of gravity is very much towards the bottom of the unit. This means you can reach for the top buttons without worrying about the device tipping forward in your palm. Before we dive into the use of the unit, you have to go through the usual motions of setting up the Horizon Pro just like any other Android TV based device. 
After pairing the remote when requested, you are first greeted by one gigabytes plus update that seems to optimize some pretty fundamental elements, like sound, picture quality, and input lag. Installing it is pretty straightforward, and the projector restarts after completing the process. When operating, you can hear the soothing sound of the active cooling within the X Jimmy Horizon Pro. Clocking in at 41.6 decibels at a mere 20 centimeters directly behind the unit's exhaust vent, any audio from your movie or game will easily drown this out. In comparison, a PlayStation 5 can be as loud as 41.5 decibel from even 3 feet away. With its advertised 2200 ANSI lumens, the Horizon line is not only the brightest projector family from XJimmy, but also nearly twice as bright as the H2 and magnitudes brighter than the Halo at 800 or MoGo Pro Plus at 300 ANSI lumens for a 4K projector in the $1600 price range. The Horizon Pro manages to hold its own against other DLP units of that price bracket. Naturally, you won't be able to match the 5000, 7000 ANSI lumens of short throw laser based projectors, but keep in mind that those also tend to cost three times as much as the Horizon Pro. With its brightness, we put the X Jimmy Horizon Pro through the worst possible scenario next to a large balcony window in the early afternoon with nearly direct sunlight. In this setting, even the LED TV sometimes lack the chops to outshine its surroundings. Thus, it is not surprising that the Horizon Pro is not quite able to match that luminosity either, but it still allows the user to easily navigate around and use the device. The Android TV interface is all standard, and thanks to it being version 10, there are no ads to be found. As soon as you open the YouTube app on both Google TV and the Horizon Pro, there no longer are any visual differences, either. With the X Jimmy Horizon Pro put through the paces in a suboptimal setting, we waited until it was dark out, and it is at this point that the 4K projector really managed to flex its muscles. The Android TV as well as Google TV interfaces were bright, with all the dark areas clearly visible as well. Sitting on the couch around 140 inches away from a 90 inch screen was quite the experience, and as you can see, the glass top of the table manages to reflect an illuminated image as well. Looping back to the Top Gun Maverick trailer in 4K, the screen where Tom Cruise's silhouette is placed inside has the lit frame of the hangar doors provide plenty of retail in the dark. The hangar door to the right of him has clearly visible elements, more than a shot of the camera can provide. The in-flight shot and more diverse third screen grab are both so much nicer to look at as well. The X Jimmy Horizon Pro does an excellent job with 4K footage. Lastly, we fired up Death Stranding on the PC in all its 4K glory and picked a scene from the prologue, where the main character is standing at the edge of a cave entrance, with colorful, well-lit elements in the center and dark cave walls all around. With the dark room, you can even make out the texture of the stone walls well. The X Jimmy Horizon Pro sits squarely in the budget price segment when it comes to 4K projectors, that is by no means a bad thing as it manages to offer a lot for the money. While not a trivial amount of money spent, higher-end units or UST 4K projectors can break that 5-digit pricing barrier which puts it into perspective. So for those wanting a 4K projector, simply the price should make the X Jimmy Horizon Pro appear on your short list of devices to consider. That said, there are naturally some drawbacks. At 2200 ANSI lumens, it is also right in the ballpark with other Unix of the segment, but that does not compare to what you get for brightly lit rooms with a similarly priced TV. This should be mentioned even if an issue with DLP-based projectors in general. Those who want a much higher probability of a great viewing experience in their sunlit living room need to consider laser projection, which also ups the price considerably. The X Jimmy Horizon Pro ends up being a cohesive 4K projector, giving you a viable alternative to a large 4K TV at a similar price point. While there may be slightly more affordable, slightly brighter entry-level 4K DLP units out there, those lack the size, smartness, automation and picture setup or longevity the Horizon Pro offers. All those elements make the X Jimmy Horizon Pro the better, more balanced choice. Thank you for watching, see you soon.